Greetings, garden enthusiasts. If you want to make a statement in your dry garden, in addition to this four-leaf clover that we'll talk about in a little bit, you might want to consider Watsonia mariana. This is an iris relative from South Africa. It comes in corms, and over time, it will eventually make a clump of many tiered spires here. This clump is 15 years old, originally purchased at Heronswood, but now we've got about 35 spires in excess of six feet. These make superb cut flowers too. Each of the spires will bloom from the bottom to the top in succession. Then we've got some side shoots coming off as well. This coral pink Watsonia is growing above Alstromerias of nearly the same color. The Alstromerias are just about finished. The Watsonia is just beginning. This Watsonia is a clumper, not a runner, and will stay in a pretty tight circle for many years. It's growing in a gravel bed here. That is a key feature for its survival, is excellent drainage. Its neighbors are many other plants from Southern and Eastern Africa, such as this Oxalis depii iron cross, every one a four-leaf clover, a purple eucamus, a diorama that's just budding up here. All three of those are from South Africa, and also Acanthus cinei from the mountains of Ethiopia. So if we consider the example of our buzzing pollinator friend here, we too can be happy in the garden with Watsonia Mariana. Ciao.